All right, going in blind to this. Best of Summer Game Fest trailers. I missed it earlier. It's like a two-hour presentation. I don't care about watching all the in-betweens. I don't know any of the games yet. It's I'm going completely blind, except for, of course, it says right in the bottom corner I spelled myself with The Last of Us remake, which is fine. I've never played Last of Us. I know it's a good game. It's apparently, like, game of the year quality, but don't know much about it. Last of Us remake coming out. All right, spelled myself there, and that's it. Okay, here we go. Let's, let's play and see what's up. So why'd you leave Boston? I've been what's on up, quite Bobby? the adventure, little brother. I reckon it's got something to do with that girl. He's got everything to do with that little girl. Yeah, I don't think I'd ever play Last of Us. I don't know. It doesn't seem like my kind of game. Probably be better as a movie. It's the outside? <laughs> oh, is that everything you movie game. For? Can't be any worse out there. Can it? Once upon a time, I had somebody that I cared about. And in this Wait, world, that's good for remake? one thing. Wasn't there like already like killed. an HD version or like remastered or something like that? Of How many close calls have we had? Okay. This is a remake all together. You make every shot count. Got really milking the fans, huh? Hmm. Hope you know how to use that thing. I've had some practice. Turn it down a little bit. That was quite loud. Theatrical, though. Sergeant Leo Alvarez of the CM Leth Recon Squad. Our mission was to enter the Tantalus base. What's up, Outward? Relay and bring it back online. How you doing? We found the relay, but it was a. <clears throat> Thanks for stopping by, my dude. Door closed now, private. Close that, close that gate. Nothing gets in here. This isn't Last of Us. What's this? Hmm. Willis, take the lead. Oh, this ain't good. What we found was a new kind of evil. Just playing Fortnite with Vaxi and Happy? That's what's up. That's... Aliens? Could be an alien game. There's been some good alien games out there. Not that I've played them, but I, I heard. Yeah, it is aliens. You got it, dude. Holy. There's an older alien game on Nintendo DS that I want to play, because it's like my style of game. It's a Metroidvania, like side-scrolling, travel the map, but it's based off of like literally these movies. I think it's called Alien Extinction or something. I'm going to go back and play that one day. Maybe on stream. I don't know what I saw in there. I know when I close my eyes. You've got it though, that's I sick. Good guess. It's been a long time since I've seen one of these movies, but they were good. And someone needs to know. <laughs> and it's pretty fun? That's what's up. Cool. So the alien games are actually uh, like successful in today's age, huh? Oh, what? Is this the gameplay? It's like bird's eye view like that? That makes it so much more exciting. So every, all that other stuff was just cutscenes then. Dude, that's more interesting than I thought it was. Hmm. I had 
nothing. Kind of like an RTS. I like RTS games. Not gonna lie, it's been a while since I've been into one, but it's people. They're addicting. Gotham gave me everything. It deserves to. A Robin game. Nightwing. Oh, okay. Have you seen? Yeah, of course I've seen Starship Troopers. That shit's badass. Good movie. No matter how hard we try, there's always more to do. And now, it's up to me. RTS for that comes out on the 16th. That sounds hype. I'd consider getting and playing that. I got this, Bruce. I'll throw it on my wish list on Steam right now. Dude. Discovery, this is command. Storm's in your way. Prepare for extraction. Signal's breaking up. Command, I'll do one last scan. See you soon. Over. Okay, hurry. Command, I may be on to something. I have it, Command. Repeat, I have it. Mission accomplished. That thing looks like it would her right up. MZ, you're wanting to see Hollow Knight stuff, but I know it won't happen. Anything by Square, any Metroidvania. Dang. We'll see. Glad you could make it. We gotta move. Now. Stormgate, huh? Look pretty interesting. How far did you get? Uh, well, I finished the main prologue and two of four of Ad Edelgard's route, but I still have all four chapters in uh, Claude's and Dimitri's route to go to. It's really time consuming in between the chapters too because you really want to talk to everybody and like try to get as much support points as you can otherwise it's a waste. Ooh, Venom. Anything to do with symbiotes is cool.
Who the? Mother? What is this? What is she, Geneva? Typical Parker luck. I'm gonna need some backup. That Spider-Man's cool. Master of Puppet. Midnight Suns. Dude, I don't know if I don't know enough about Marvel to be honest to know what this is. But it looks kinda neat. Harriet Osman, huh? That used to always work. Well it did that one time. You won't know what hit you. Let me have some fun. Let's get this mission started. Okay. I actually seen some news about Street Fighter 6 on Twitter, but like the other day. So now I'm get to, getting to see a little bit more about that, if that's what this is. I'm pretty sure it is. Because that looks like Guile to me. I will be getting Street Fighter 6 for sure on PS5. Fuck yeah. Gotta mess around with this a bit. On Xbox 2? What? In Steam? Street Fighter 5 was never on Xbox, was it? That's crazy. I almost wish they'd keep it to just PlayStation, but. Yeah, more the merrier, I guess. This be like kill zone or something? Clear. Coming out. Imagine they brought that back. Nah, there's no way that's this. Actually, the graphics look too good. Maybe it's like just another Call of Duty or something. Moving. 
into the main deck. What's your status? Boarding the ship with Shadow 3 now. Roger that. <laughs> That's brutal. We need to move fast. All shadows force out. I want eyes on that container Th now. Throw a little nade in there. We got to roll. Shadow one, go. Visual old flares coming from the ring. Push your players over. Ghost, they're signaling the ship. They're going to launch that missile. It's first stage. There's no time. On that damn ship. Actual, we got a problem. This was somewhere on the ship. You have your orders, son. Stop that launch. Yeah, this looks dangerous. You'd think there'd be people on that ship looking out, shooting at him already. Ah, well, there you go. Let's have ourselves a gunfight. Missile controls are on the bridge. Have to stop the launch. Well, this is intense. Know that the same guy who played Anakin was in Spider-Man 3? Was he? Which Anakin? The Anakin from episode 1 or the Anakin from episode 2 and 3? I'm trying to, I'm trying to rethink about Spider-Man 3 here. from Phantom Menace. The first one, then. No, I didn't know that. That's cool. 
I, I didn't know that kid was in anything else after that. Yeah, when he learns the force, he gets the powers. <laughs> Pre-order now and get early access to the open beta. Hmm. Oh, look at this guy, he's huge. So you're gonna restore the colon and hopefully save the day. I have no idea. Other than Street Fighter, is like everything new just war games? Wait, is that Wreck It Ralph? Oh no, definitely not. Oh, is this not Gears of War? Is it, I don't know. No, it's not. Gears of War was the version, right? Yeah, I have no clue what it could be. Magic. Warhammer? I thought Warhammer was like RTS games or something. What are you waiting for? Get in your place. Or like MOBA. Warhammer 4000 Dark Tide, okay. Hmm. So it was made by War Warhammer or something, that's why I thought that, but uh huh. What's this? Is this some sort of uh Atlas fighting game? Or like Guilty Gear or some shit? Defense force. I have no idea. But it's Japanese and uh, those games are usually cooler than what we've been seeing, I think. Got some dog dudes. Okay. Zenless Zone Zero, is that what it's called? That was interesting looking. One of the cooler things we've seen, I think. You're alone in the realms, I'm afraid, for portals are a hmm. mess. Not even sure if Nightingale made it. Given how fragile you humans are, I'd say that staying fed, dry, and rested should be your priority. If the portal arch is inactive, you'll need to make realm cards from rare resources. Once you have realm cards, you can activate the portal. Beware the foul things lurk in the interrealm. Is this a new IP altogether, or is this based off of something? You can't tell yet. It's just... Craft Realm cards? 
Okay, it's looking kind of new. Ooh, spider so. Uh -oh. It's all in the cards. Trust in the cards. Believe in the cards. Or whatever Yugi says. Someone once said insanity runs uh. in our family. What Didn't even say what that one was, just cut it off. Horror game? Okay. Psychedelic Horror Chronicle. I see it. All this misery. All this suffering. There was no other way. It does seem kind of psychedelic, huh? You throw psychedelic in the title and I'm a little more interested. You really shouldn't have. Unreal Engine 5, huh? Interesting looking one. If it was third person, I'd be more interested, but still looks pretty cool for those who will play it. Outside. Did you know that they call Callisto the dead moon? Dead. Just like you would have been if I hadn't fished that, you like out Dead of space or whatever? I don't know those games, so I could be wrong. So whatever you're holding on to right there, that's your old life. You gotta let that go. Because your new life oh, shit. is entirely in my hands I'm just trying to give you a chance at rebirth intense sci-fi horror I just love that last part few sci-fi horror games sci-fi horror shooting games gives me shooting alien every time what's up Gigi hey ghost booty hey oh I hope you're doing well Thanks for stopping by. Nasty. Welcome to your new home. Did 
The Callisto Protocol. Okay, so a new IP altogether? It's Dead Space 2. Same thing, right? Digital 1 edition or the deluxe edition for the exact same thing. I guess that was it. Were there any indie titles? Um, because like best of isn't going to show indie stuff, right? Were there any indie titles at all? I guess. A Bosu indie sho showcase? Hmm. Google Cuphead DLC on YouTube? Was there a new video on that? Six hours ago? Full presentation? Three three minutes? Thank you, dude. That's best of my ass. This is the best of right here. Thank you. Can you believe it? We're only a couple weeks away from playing the Delicious Last Course DLC. You see how they did that for Cuphead? Joining me now is Maya Maldenhauer from Studio MDHR. So first of all, Maya, it's really coming? It's really coming June 30th on all major platforms. We are thrilled. Well, I'm so thrilled too that uh, I think all the fans can't believe that this is here. And I've been lucky enough to play this actually on my Steam Deck uh, last week and you guys gave me a copy. This People are not going to be ready for how amazing this looks. We're not going to be ready! You guys have to, I feel like you've We're not going to be ready! The gameplay, it's difficult as we would expect, but the visual look, you guys have taken it even to the next level. You got Chalice looking all pretty over there. I couldn't pinpoint one thing that we're proud of. Let's go. We really honed our craft. Took everything to the next level from animation, the backgrounds, the music, gameplay design, um, and of course a new playable character, Miss Chalice. I'm very proud of her. Chalice is fun to play. Indie games are so much more hype than AAA games nowadays for me. Game inside of Cuphead in many things. It is, it is, definitely. Yeah, you just get get on the island and, and there you are off to this new uh new territory, which is amazing. Yeah, it's our biggest island yet. Super sized bosses. Biggest island yet. Um, don't let Secrets! Yes, and lots of challenge ahead. Well, I know you brought. I, I know you want. You don't want people to necessarily ha have too much spoiled about the game, but you brought a little something. For a little right. something, yeah. It's a uh, brand new gameplay footage of one of our new bosses, Mortimer Freeze. It takes place in an icy arena, um, and features some of my personal favorite um, attacks and transformations. We hope everyone enjoys it. All right, let's check it out. Cuphead, the delicious last course. Thanks, Mile. Mortimer Freeze. Let's see him. Okay, okay. Some... Alright. Oh, shit. Moving battlefield. Oh, what? what the fuck is she shooting? That's a new gun? I wonder if it's gonna be locked behind just her or if anyone can use that. I'm also wondering if Chalice is gonna be absolutely necessary to beat any of these new bosses. So. Okay, everybody can definitely use that. That's just a new gun. That's... It's like a spreader, but further. Oh, that's new. That's a new super. Oh, that parry was nuts. Look at her go. Oh, shit. Mortimer Freeze is done. That looks like it might have been on easy mode. Yo, thanks, GG. <laughs> want even more Cuphead, and who doesn't? Tomorrow we will show you an exclusive look at season two of the Cuphead show when I co-host Netflix's Geek Week, which will include new show and game announcements. It streams at 10 a.m. Pacific, 1 p.m. Eastern. And hype. Okay, that was the most hype thing. For sure. Um, Summer Game Fest 2022 Indie. Reveals. Three X Summer Game Fest. No, 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 no. New leaks and rumors. No, 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 no. Three hours ago. No, no, no. I'm not trying to watch any other YouTuber here. I just want to see what's up. Was that the only indie game reveal? Or was there like a tidbit, like a, a section for it, for it? There wasn't, eh? If anything, that was the most hyped thing. For sure. Regardless. Okay. Well, hey. Cool. I'm uh, I'm stoked for the Cuphead stuff. Mortimer Freeze looks dope. I'm gonna um go to a quick little be right back screen here while I uh, set up Fire Emblem. We'll get a good uh, hour or three in on that. And uh, yeah, thanks for checking that out with me, guys.